In today's tutorial, we will be exploring typical generic drum patterns that lay the foundation for contemporary electronic club music, from basic to more developed examples using a variety of sounds and samples. Ooh. Hi, my name is Akito. I'm a London-based DJ and beat maker. Today's tutorial is a beginner's guide to sequencing drums for the club, showing you how they may sound and how they are laid out visually in what I believe is their average BPM. These patterns will be pretty generic. Very generic. They are just a starting point and are simply examples of sequences in different genres. This aims to be helping the journey of you finding your own sound. I highly suggest picking and choosing the elements that excite you the most, then blending and experimenting with them in your own production to see what you can cook up. The limitations only exist in our imagination and execution, so free feel to go wild. All the drums that I used in this video are part of my debut drum sample pack, 100 Hits. It's available exclusively through my website, Akitomart. I've left the link in the description for you. I've intentionally not included Ballroom and Vogue in this video. It's obviously a massive influence to club music and myself, but as a straight male, a respect for the culture and my lack of contribution towards it, I have decided to leave it out. First off, we're going to start with house music. Typically a 4-4 beat with claps and snares dropping on the second and fourth beats of the bar. Here's a very basic stripped back example. Here's example two, adding an additional sound and a variation to the groove. And number two is UK Funky. There can be, but not always, a 4-4 kick drum pattern. Typically, the percussion dances around the kick drums creating highly head-bopping, dance floor-friendly rhythms to shake your gun finger to. Here's example one with a 4-4 beat. Here's example two without. Techno. Usually 4-4 four, four in nature, but always with everything we're covering today, this is a personal choice. Techno can be extremely dark and minimal to brash and abrasive. Beautiful too. It can also vary heavily in speed. It's worth bumping up and down the BPM in your DAW and see what bangs for you if techno's your cup of tea. Here's an example. Next up, we have Rom. I hope I pronounced that correctly. Dark and sinister percussive loops decorated in chants and drones originating from South Africa. It has played a massive role and influence in club music of recent years. If you want to hear a great example of how, I'd highly suggest checking out Scratcher DVA's drum track series. I've left a link to his bandcamp in the description for you. Next up, we got Baile Funk. Born in Brazil, usually stripped back loops with heavily swung and syncopated percussion, making for real high energy club music that can be really difficult to mix. Here is an example of a current 130 BPM Baile Funk drum pattern. <laughs> Next up, we got Two Step Garage, a subgenre of UK garage. Next, we have Grime. 
Grime, known for its darker beats and sound palette that make for MC friendly backing tracks. The sound really takes me back to Pirate Radio. These beats are usually quite sparse, leaving plenty of room for the MC as well as synths and bass lines. Here's an example of the drums. Next, we have dubstep. Whoa, 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 whoa. Developing from the roots of garage, dubstep is synonymous but not restricted to loud sub basses with claps or snares falling on the middle third beat of a bar. And all the way from the US, we have footwork. It was birthed in the early 90s in Chicago. Relentlessly rapid tracks and tools used for dance battles with a focus on footwork. Here is an example I've created. Next is Trap, known for its hi-hat rolls and 808 drum patterns. The style has really cut through and crossed over into pop, club and plenty more, as well as creating offshoots like Drill. And next is reggaeton. Also developed in the 90s, reggaeton kicked off in Puerto Rico, influenced heavily by the sounds of Caribbeans in the US, usually topped with Spanish vocals. Its ever-growing popularity is international and is one of the most streamed genres of music. Here is a simple example I have created. Keep this video short and concise, I've skipped a few genres. Please list any you'd like to see in the comments and I'll cook up edition two. Also, if you know anyone that would appreciate and benefit from this video, please feel free to share and pass it along to them. Stay safe.